Hey everybody, day 11 of Trovember. Hashtag Trovember is the the way to find what's going on. Uh, Kelly over at Collage Lab is hosting this month-long collage challenge. Um, so be sure and check her out. So today's prompt for day 11 is add something old-fashioned. And I pulled out some... Um, a stack of you know, my chair situated here. A stack of patterns. Um, these are old fashioned to me because I I know people use them still today, but I don't feel like they do. If that makes sense. Very rarely do people make their own clothes. So, um, <clears throat> so I was initially thinking I would use some of this. Um, because it's light and it's, it's fun collage fodder, basically. But, I'm not feeling it. Um, and so I grabbed these and I'm not feeling any of these folks, but I am feeling this lady here. I guess I'm on a color wave here, um, with this collage, so... I'm going to cut her out, and we'll fussy cut her, and we'll stick her on there somewhere. She's pretty old-fashioned. Thinking of that, how much are patterns these days? This one was 65 cents. Is there a way to tell what year? 1966. So, there you go. cut her out. Although I like that little simplicity. I still want to cut her out, I think. I'm busy cutting her right to the edge. She should be a fairly easy cut. Her fingers are Um, subdued. <laughs> They're not all hanging out all fingery and willy-nilly. She's kind of cool. Her colors match. And everything. It kind of inspires me to want to... I have a whole box of patterns. And it inspires me to want to kind of... Dig through them and harvest. <laughs> Instead of them just hanging around... In a box. If I went through and harvested the covers... You know, and cut out any people. And then cold down the insides a little bit. Maybe I could. It's in a box stored under my table. Maybe I could open up some more room. Maybe. Oh, come on. I'm hanging on to this little simplicity tag for a minute. It might work its way in here somewhere. Might. Okay, lady, where do you want to be? I keep putting you down here. But is that where you want to be? Do you want to be up here? I kind of like you up here, but I feel like this area here needs, do you need to come over here in the corner, or do I need to bring you closer to the bird and the, I 
I think I like you there. I'm not going to cut out your innards from your arm because um, that is just too tedious for me this morning. <laughs> but we're going to glue you down with some weld bond. Again, because we're working with the uneven layers in this collage. I think it might have even been all the previous years, but I feel like I've used um, uh, Mod Podge. I'm picking the glue off of my paddle here is what I'm doing. Um, I feel like I used Mod Podge in the in the years past, and I if if you remember my day one video, I started out trying to use that, but these my background painting pages were so thick that Mod Podge was actually laughing at me, so we had to switch gears, and I switched gears, and I didn't switch back, and so that's okay. No rules that says you have to use something, certain glue or anything like that. Get you all squished down. And I'll probably do Mod Podge over the top of everything. How about right there? I like her. I, I like her as collage material. So, um, again, that inspires me to kind of... If I do it right there, I'll chop off the bird's nose. And we'll squeeze over a little bit. <coughs> it inspires me to cull. See, I mean, she would be really pretty. So, yeah, we have us a new fuzzy cut adventure. <laughs> so, <clears throat> day 11 for Collage Labs uh, Trovember was to add something old-fashioned. And so we have added this lovely lady in her old-fashioned dress. And she's from a pattern to me is old-fashioned. So, um, there you have it. Thanks for joining me. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye for now.